You like jazz? I love jazz. Nice. Hey Seawolves, what's up? I'm Ryan. And I'm Aubrey. And today we're out here on the streets asking you guys about your best or worst dates. Let's go. All right, so I was wondering if you could tell us a little bit about your best date you've ever been on. Okay, so my best date was probably in San Diego. Um, I, we went to a baseball game and then the guy I was dating said that if I won, then we can go anywhere I wanted. So I ended up going to um, Hotel Dell after. It was really fun and we watched the stars and everything. What a guy. Yeah. <laughs> I hate him now, but it's okay. <laughs> I decided to take this girl to Chipotle okay. and um, I told her, hey, like, that was my favorite place to eat at. Um, you know, if, if you don't like it, it's not going to work out. And she said, yeah, actually, this is my favorite place too. And so, um, turns out, it worked out great. And so, uh, here we are now. I had a really nice dinner at Prelude. I think everyone should go if they have the opportunity. Um, and after Prelude, we went to a jazz concert uh, at the GMC. Uh, if anyone has the opportunity to go see the jazz trio, I definitely think you should. Um, but yeah, that was my perfect romantic date. What is your worst date experience? My worst date experience, um, this guy asked me out to dinner, we went, and then he just decided to drop that he was 30 years old and I'm 21. <laughs> I was hanging with this this boy who I was on a date with, and then my other friend comes in, and he's like such a little pest, right? So like after uh, like fifth period or whatever, we went to Taco Bell. I bought her Taco Bell. We had Taco Bell. I mean, she said like, yeah, this is gonna work out, and just left. After like, she, you bought it for her. Yeah, like no, she wow. used me for Taco Bell. Like it was a finesse. I'll give her that. He was like, hey Emily, like hey Emily, what's going on? Like what are you doing here? Like huh, what's going on? I was like, oh my god, like you're ruining my freaking first date. There was this one time, it was actually my first day in high school, I took a girl mini golf and uh, uh, I hit my ball into there's like a little pond and I hit my ball into the water and then I was you know, trying to be cool uh, and I said, oh I can just go get it, you know, and, like reach in or whatever and uh, I definitely fell in and I definitely had to be escorted off the premises because I fell in and there was this green dye in the water and I wore a nice white shirt and the shirt was ruined. Um, was there a second date? Uh, yeah, I'm actually, I actually married the girl. Oh, wow, yeah. all right. So then I went to like smack him with my jacket because I had a jacket in my hand. So I was like, go away. But then the guy I was on a date with had glasses. So when I moved the jacket to smack Owen, it knocked my this guy's glasses on the ground and they shattered and broke. And did you I was ever like, see him again? <laughs> not for like a whole month, he did not talk to me. So Ryan, can you describe your perfect date? It's a tough one, but uh... I'd have to say April 25th. Not too hot, not too cold, all you need is a light jacket. We'll catch you next time on the streets. See ya!